The world's too big, Mom. Then make it small. Focus on my voice. Pretend it's an island out in the ocean. Can you see it? I see it. My son was in the bus. He saw what Clark did. You have to keep this side of yourself a secret. What was I supposed to do? Just let him die? Maybe. I have so many questions. Where do I come from? You just have to decide what kind of man you want to grow up to be, Clark. Whoever that man is, he's going to change the world. Okay, so the Man of Steel trailer just came out, so I wanted to film my reaction right away. So I'm at my desk, it's a little noisy, I apologize for that. But, uh, so the whole time I've been talking about Man of Steel, you all know I, I'm really worried about the movie. But everyone says, Grace, if you see more footage, you will totally change your mind. And I have to say, I feel a little better, but I still, I still feel that my reservations still stand. So, but first let's talk about what I was surprisingly happy about when I saw this trailer. Kevin Costner, by far and away, if they could make a Paw Kent movie, I would see it. I think that's brilliant casting. I think he perfectly personifies uh, personifies the Superman mythos. I think that it just really gets it right. And if he was younger, I would say that maybe he would make a great Superman. So I like that, and I, I, I like the I like the starkness and the harshness of the truth of the conversation he has with the young Clark about that school bus incident that we see in the trailer. So I, I kind of actually really like all the Smallville stuff. I think that's really great. Um, and then I like the shot when you see Superman from behind in the snow walking with the cape in the wind. I think that's really cool as well. Uh, so I, I like all that stuff. I'm, I'm very excited about it. But so, but what I didn't like, I still don't like the dark tone, uh, the visual tone of the film. I think it's not Superman. It's not what the character is about. I don't like that at all. And it, it doesn't seem to be going away at all. So I'm not, I'm not a fan of that. And you know, it, it's the same color palette as Superman Returns. I, I just would have stayed away from that. Uh, I don't like Henry Cavill. I'm sorry. I just don't think he's Superman. I don't think he has the profile for it. I don't think he has uh, the seriousness as an actor. Uh, he just seems a little light to me. So I have problems with that casting and I just don't, I just don't see Superman when I see him, when I see him move, when I see him talk, anything. I just never see Superman and I never see Clark Kent. I, I think he's miscast. Uh, and the other thing, I don't like the music they chose. I don't, some, I saw some people saying maybe it was Gladiator-esque. To me it seems Enya-like. And it's just, it's just not Superman. And everyone always says Superman is like a wimp compared to Batman. And I don't think music like that helps him. So I, I think Superman's always bright and exciting. And I think that a precedent has been set by the Richard Donner film and the animated series uh, from Bruce Timm and Paul Dini. And, uh, you know, if you're going to break from that, I, I'm okay. I'm open to that. But I think that you have to kind of not go too far in the opposite direction. I, I could be proven wrong, but again, I'm not crazy about what I'm seeing, except for basically the Smallville stuff and Kevin Costner. But I, I'll see the film. Uh, I'd like to see some more action. I hope the third trailer has some action sequences, because I think that that's where I think this movie could really shine and where Zack Snyder will 
best come into play. So what do you think? Uh, for those of you who saw the San Diego Comic-Con footage, is this what you've been talking about or are they still holding more back? For those of you who are seeing new footage for the first time like myself, what do you think? What do you think of Kevin Costner? What do you think of Henry Cavill? Write your thoughts down below and thank you for coming to be on the trailer for the latest trailers in these quick snapshot reviews. Thanks for watching. Bye.